Hello everyone. Welcome to Vidya's Cake Fantasy. Today's cake is chocolate truffle cake. So let's get started. So for this cake, we need chocolate sponge cake. So I have already baked the cake. I'm going to remove the top part. Now I'm going to trim the cake. The reason I'm trimming the cake is just I I need to get a proper round shape for the cake. So I'm trimming the top layer. Now I'm going to give the first layer. I'm going to cut the first layer. So like I always say, just place your knife over the cake and rotate your table and then do the zigzag method so that you will get a perfect layer so this is a 6 inch cake and my first part is ready now the second layer same method place your knife and rotate the table so we'll get a outline of the cake then do the zigzag method and cut the cake so the layer will be perfect so the second layer is also ready now the third layer so we we will get four layers of, for this cake If you guys like my video don't forget to subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon So now we have got our layers properly So done with our layers So time to prepare our ganache so I have used dark compound chocolate over here so the ratio for making ganache is 2 is to 1 that is 200 grams of dark compound chocolate and 100 grams of amul fresh cream. So basically your chocolate should be double the portion compared to your fresh cream. Now melt this chocolate in a double boiler method or in a microwave for 30 seconds interval. Now I am going to use this ganache for making truffle. So in a bowl I have added whipping cream and into this whipping cream I am going to mix the ganache, chocolate ganache. So after mixing the ganache our truffle will be ready. So I am going to add 2 spoons of my ganache into the whipping cream and I am going to give a nice mix. So if you want you can add another tablespoon of ganache to your whipping cream. Now I am going to give a nice mix. So after mixing the cream, your truffle will be ready. So this is your truffle. Our truffle is ready. We will keep this aside and we will start layering our cake. Now I am going to place the cake layers. So this is the second layer which we layered the cake. So I am going to soak this cake using a sugar syrup. I have mixed 2 tablespoons of powder sugar in half a cup of water. I need very light sweet as the whole cake will be sweet. So I have added very less sugar and I am going to soak the cake. Now I am going to add the truffle which we prepared already. So adding ganache into your whipping cream will be your truffle. Now with the help of a palette knife, I am going to smooth the cream. After smoothing the cream, just hold your palette knife and rotate the table so the excess cream will be left out. To this again we are going to add the ganache. And again with the help of a palette knife, I am going to smooth the ganache. After adding ganache, you can also add some choco chips into this 
or you can also add hazelnut into your cake so this way you can you can decorate your cake it's up to you now i'm going to place the first layer and i'm going to smooth the cake from the sides again soak your cake and repeat the process add your truffle cream again your ganache smooth the cream place your next layer soak your cake and repeat the process so finally i'm going to place the last layer and i'm going to cover the cake with little bit of cream truffle cream for chocolate sponge cake always soak your cake properly and crumb coat your cake with little bit of cream so after crumb coating your cake refrigerate your cake for 20 minutes then after 20 minutes again i'm going to add the same truffle cream or just a single layer for my cake smooth your cake from sides from the top as well after smooth the cream with the help of a palette knife now i am going to smooth the cake using a scraper that is i am going to remove the excess cream using a scraper so from the sides i have used removed the excess cream with the help of a scraper now from the top again i am going to level my cake with the help of a palette knife so again we need a, a ganache for our truffle cake so the i already told you the ratio that is 2 is to 1 so 200 grams of dark compound chocolate and 100 grams of amul fresh cream and melt your chocolate using a double boiler method or in a microwave if you are using a microwave then melt your chocolate in 30 seconds batch wise now pour the ganache all over your cake and just tap the cake so that the excess ganache will remove from the cake after pouring the ganache allow the ganache to settle and then remove the cake from the base and then place your cake into the board cake board now using the same truffle cream i have just given some lines just for the design now using a 46 nozzle number i am going to give modak shape so alternate wise i am going to place the modak shape or modak design and with the same nozzle i am going to give border design also shell design so i'm going to cover my cake with shell design as a border so for decoration i have some chocolate balls with me so i'm just placing the chocolate balls on the top of the truffle just for a decoration purpose and then decorate your chocolate truffle cake with some silver balls our chocolate truffle cake is ready now thanks for watching